how to get started with the medium in this step-by-step -step tutorial i'm going to be showing you how we can create some amazing articles starting from scratch so let's dig into it so guys the very first thing you need to understand is that nobody really nobody knows how to actually write a thing you don't have to worry about if you didn't study this subject you don't have to worry about if you don't know any kind of topic um, almost anyone these days can create a blog, an article, so it's really easy to get started. The very first thing we want to do now is to go into Medium.com and here to get started. So what we want to do is to go and join Medium, sign it up with a Google account, a Facebook or an email. In my case, I want to actually sign up with my email. I'm going to input my email and hit it to continue. Once I have successfully added and verified my website, my actual email is going to be asking of our full name. So here what I want to do is to type, let's say, Brian and Crane. And I'm going to leave it like that and hit into create account. So let's dig in here. The very first thing that I want to show you about Medium is to actually start with your profile. So as almost any platform is going to be asking about your interest, so it's going to be more easier to help you with getting the tools and the right blocks so you can start being influenced and inspired to add yourself. So in our case, let's focus into grinding, let's focus into the technology, and let's focus into design. After that, hit into continue. Then it's going to be asking for the actual navigation. I'm going to hit into OK, I got it. And you can see that there is a for you page, the following, the design, technology and writing. So this one appears depending on what is the subject you just choose. In our case, we choose this three of them and you can see the for you following. This one are going to be followed depending on what are the actual people that you are following. You can connect your Twitter account if you wanted to, but we are not going to be focusing on that. So for example, if I go with the, let's say for example, Christina God speaking about this side, I'm going to look out for something else actually. I'm going to scroll a little bit down. Let's say the Prince, this one. And if I like the content of this guys, I'm going to hit into the follow section. So now this one is going to appear into the for you page and the following as well. I'm going to go back here in the medium section on the very first part. And now you can see I have the for you section where there are people related into the one that I just described. And the following, it's only with the person that I just follow, which in our case is Mr. Prince. Now, in order to get started with writing, you want to go into the very upper side and you want to choose the option that says write. Or if you want to actually, let's say that become a little bit more featured into medium.com, you want to choose into your profile and you want to personalize your account. For example, the home section, the about section and all of that. After you finish that, you can always go into write and we can get started. What is up with getting started? As you can see, it's really easy to get started by creating a blog, creating a website, creating an article. It's always the same deal. We have here the title, we have to tell your story, and there's a plus button that appears in here. So speaking about your very first article, you don't have to be worrying about that. Let's say that I do want to talk about my own space in the 2022 my own space in the 2023 so tell your story this is just an example so uh once i do have uh let's say that i just written something really really easy if i hit into the enter mark you're gonna be seeing this plus button if i click this option it's gonna be appearing different tools that can be added into my actual uh, article for example i do have the gallery I do have the add an image from Unsplashed. I do have the add a video. I can add a NBM code, a code blocked, and lastly, I can add a new part. So if I want to add a new part, it's going to be cracked it uh, with three dots and I can add something else, some different time of else here. Now select text to title formatting, add headers or create links. If I choose next, for example, here is going to be appearing all the different tools that I can be using to actually customize my actual website or my article in this case. Once you are familiarized with all of these elements, hit into the X marks and we can start to work. And now let's talk about the icebreaker. So if you're just getting started with the article and you actually don't know where to start, you don't have to worry about that. Let's say that you just want to focus into just one subject. For example, let's say I'm gonna type here, I'm gonna go and look out for something really, really easy to talk about. For example, Apple versus Android. There we go. So uh, I'm gonna delete this. I'm gonna have uh, actually let's say iPhone versus Android. And here I can start the subject. So 
Uh, what I want to defocus is into just three elements in order to actually just provide my arguments here into the article. So I'm going to go and add those, for example, here have the article number one, which is the introduction. Now into the introduction, what I want to do is to focus into what is the main subject and why do I care about this article or of this subject. Now, the number two is going to be the body of my article. Here into the body, I want to say, I want to just uh, express my own opinion. And if you want, you can add uh, more sources, some more sources, for example. And lastly, I do have the conclusion. So here into the conclusion, uh, I just want to add my last words and a few incentives and thoughts for the reader. So with those three elements, uh, what I want to do is to use a tool that can be helping me to uh, actually write more information about the iPhone versus the Android. So I can strongly suggest you if you don't know how to get started, you can go into ChatGPT. ChatGPT is going to be helping you to create whatever you wanted to. So if I want to start um, an article about iPhone versus Android, here I want to go into ChatGPT. Creating an account is really, really easy. So uh, create an introduction. I'm going to hit create an introduction uh, article about um, iPhone versus Android. And just like that, ChatGPT is going to be starting to write the introduction of our article. So if you want to check it out, how it's going to be uh, looking here, for example, the debate between iPhone and Android has been going on for years with both sides of passionate and dedicated followers, iPhone, the world, blah, 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 blah. So as you can see, there are really strong arguments. What we want to do is to use this information, paragraphs, whatever you wanted to. And then what you can do is just to add your own opinion uh, of your actual uh, elements. So I'm going to just copy this article, for example, this story. Let's say that this is my actual introduction. So I'm going to just click into the enter mark. I'm going to enter once again. And I'm going to paste my information here. So lastly, what I just need to do is to edit my title. For example, let's say I'm going to add something like this. And here I do have the introduction. I'm going to go into the X mark. And instead of just adding the introduction, let's say, now, lastly, I do have the feeling that I might need an image here. So I'm going to type into the very end of the very first paragraph. I'm going to type it enter. I'm going to hit into the plus button, go into add an image. And here you can go into show all files. If you don't have an image, I can always go once again back. I'm going to go into add an image. I'm going to choose from unsplashed and type keyword to search from unsplashed. Let's say that I want to look for Android and hit into enter. So I have different images. Let's say for example, that I want to add this one. And there we go. So really, really easy to add this. Now I'm going to scroll a little bit down and here I want to do exactly the same thing, but instead by adding some Android phone, I'm going to go and go into unsplash and I'm going to go for iPhone like this. And now I have this element as well. So as you can see, now I have the elements and I have which one actually uh, created the actual photo. So once I have all of the information, I can start by actually customizing my website. After I finish that, I can go into published. And here into published, you have your story preview, you have your name, you have your elements, you have the published too, and you want to add as much topics as you can so people can find uh, your post more faster. With that being said, we have just created something really, really easy into Medium. But just in case you have any questions, you can leave it down below in the comment section. So this is just a really, really step tutorial uh, that you can how you can create here into medium.com, but you can be doing endless list possibilities. And now with the chat GPT, we can do so much more than this. So with that being said, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. If you don't want to see more amazing tools about the great medium.com and their tools on the creating articles. Thank you so much for watching the video once again, guys, and I'll see you next time.